Now we will do the textbook exercises of unit 1 patterns. Okay, so open page number 14 everyone. I will explain you one or two points from each exercise and you will complete that exercise by yourself. Okay, first of all, recap. First, each picture below shows a pattern. Each picture below shows a pattern. Circle the picture on the right that will come next in the pattern. Now, below each picture shows a pattern. We will circle the picture on the right that will come next in the pattern. So, here are some parrots. First of all, its face at the right hand direction. See? Right hand side. Its face at the left hand side. Then again right hand side, then left hand side, then again right hand side. Now what will come next? Left or right? Left hand side. So this one is right. Circle on this parrot. Now come to the next ball bat stem again ball bat stem again ball bat stem again ball yes again ball it is correct so circle on the ball hope you understood now complete these patterns by yourself now come to the next. Complete the pattern. Start with 1. 1, 2, 3. Again. 1, 2, 3. Again. 1, 2, 3. Again. 1, 2, 3. Again. 1, 2. Very good. I hope you understood. Well. Now come to the next page. Page number 15. Here are some beautiful pictures. Let's see. As you go up, I go down. As you go up, I go down. Up, down, up, down, up, down. This is a pattern. Do you know I also have patterns in my home? Says Pihu, as you go up, I go down. Up, down, up, down, up, down. This is a pattern. Do you know? I also have patterns in my home. We see patterns all around us. Pihu's house has many patterns. Look, have a look. Patterns in window. Patterns in grill, patterns in tiles, patterns in the floor. Here are many patterns all around us. You will also see at your home. Like you will see the walls of your house, the paintings of your house, the floor of your house, the tiles of, of your house. The windows, grills of your house. Okay. Now, come to the next page. Page number 16. Practice ground. First, draw the object that comes next in the pattern. Like, box, then two box, then three box, then four box. Then 5 box, then 6 box. Yeah? Hope you understood. Now, B. Here are 2 leaves, then 4 leaves, then 6, then 8, then 10 
leaves then 12 then then 14 hope you understood you will do or make these leaves by yourself with using your crayons color now come to the next page page number 17 we can also form patterns by using numbers for example 11 22 33 44 14 12 10 8 10 9 8 7 now remember to find the rule to continue the pattern for example 3 6 12 24 in this pattern the rule is to multiply the last number by 2 whenever we do the numbers pattern first of all we will find the rule to continue the pattern okay for example here is an example 3 6 12 24 in this pattern the rule is to multiply the last number by 2 okay now practice ground first write down the next three numbers in the pattern below write down the next three numbers in the pattern below a 5 then 15 then 25 then 35 next number is 45 then 55 then 65 how you found it first of all 5 then we jump 10 numbers right then again we jump 10 numbers again 10 again 10 again and again and again okay hope you understood now we 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 and 100 it's not very difficult always remember to find the rule to continue the pattern okay Think smart. Find the rule for the pattern below and write the next three numbers. We will find the rule for the pattern below. First of all, we will write these numbers for this pattern. 2, 3, 5, 8. So, our pattern is 2, 3, 5, 8. So, it is the next three patterns. Let's find the rule. First of all, we will start counting from 1. 1, 2, 3. From 1 to 3, we have not jumped any number, right? Like 1, 2, 3. Now, from 3, we will jump a number. The number is 4. We jumped 4 and come to the next number 5. Okay. Then 5. From 5 
to eight, we jumped from six and seven. Six and seven. We jumped from six and seven. Now, from eight to the next number, we will jump from nine, ten, and eleven. Why we jump from the three numbers? See again. Here, we didn't jumped any number then we jumped from one number then we jumped from two number then we jumped from three numbers so next number is 12 now from 12 to next number we will jump from four numbers how let's see 12 then 13, then 14, then 15, then 16. 12 to next number, we will jump from 4 numbers. So the next number is 17. Hope you understood. See here. 2 3, 5, 8, 12, 12 to 17, we jumped from 4 number, then we will jump from 5 number, then we get the next number is 22, hope you understood well, now come to the next this is an enrichment exercise. Look at these two patterns 2, 10, 18, 26 and 34. Now 84, 76, 68, 60 and 52. The patterns are 2, 10, 18, 26, 34. Next, 84, 76, 68, 60 and 52. Now the question is, what is the difference between them? We will find the difference between in both patterns, in the two patterns. Right now, look here. Our patterns are our first pattern and second pattern. The first pattern is 2, 10, 18, 26, 34. First of all, look carefully. 2 is smaller than 10 10 is smaller than 18 18 is smaller than 26 26 smaller than 34 okay now in the second pattern 84 is greater than 76 76 is greater than 68 68 is greater than then 60 and 60 is greater than 52. So remember the increasing order or decreasing order. This pattern is in increasing order and this one is Decreasing order. Now we will find the next pattern. So let's find the rule 2, then 
ten. So let's start counting from one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Now we will jump from two to ten. So jump from two to ten. We jumped from one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. We jumped from eight digit or eight numbers. Okay. So two. Then second number is eight. Then start counting from ten to eighteen, and from ten. To eighteen, we also jumped from eight numbers. Then eighteen to twenty-six, we also jumped from eight numbers. From twenty-six to thirty-four, we also jumped eight numbers. Our next number is next number is forty two. Okay, hope you understood well. Now come to our book and do this remaining pattern by yourself, and you will find you will get the difference between them. Okay, now do page number eighteen. Here is a project work. Skip this project right now. We will do this project in our future time. Now here is a fun activity. First of all, color them. Use any three colors of sorry. Use any three colors to make a pattern. You will use any three of colors. Your three favorite colors like red, blue, green. Okay. But use only three colors and make a pattern. Like if you use, if you fill this shape by red color, you will color this shape by another color, then another color, then again start the pattern. Okay, hope you understood. Now come to page number nineteen. math lab activity you will do this activity at your home with help of your parent first of all material needed poster colors instructions use your thumb prints to color the pictures one has been done as an example you will use your thumb prints you will use your thumb prints and color the pictures Like this, you will color your color your thumb, then print like this. Okay. I hope you all understood about this chapter about the patterns. You will do all the exercises. those i given in your homework 